This is Andy Pearl off Boxing Social in association with Betfred and I'm joined by Casey Benjamin here in Coventry. Casey, firstly, how are you? Good, thanks. How are you? I'm good, mate. I'm good. Now, obviously, you're getting ready for your ring return on Saturday night. How's camp gone? How are you feeling? Uh, camp's gone great. Um, feel, a, feel a, like anyone would just the day before the away in. So, uh, yeah, I just want to go chill. But um, hopefully... This fight is for a title. I don't, I don't, I'm not quite sure yet. Could be a six rounder, but should know soon. What do you know about your opponent? Nothing. I know that he's uh, from Argentina. Apart from that, nothing. <laughs> it's a case for yourself, obviously, back under the lights, the bright lights of Sky Sports. How important is it? Do you feel that you put on a show, you put on a performance, and you kind of, I don't want to say introduce yourself, but you keep everybody aware of your standing within, the, to the very least, for British boxing. Yeah, uh, I feel like I've, I'm starting to leave a presence. Um, obviously, I just want to keep getting big fights and obviously push on, hopefully get the British title at the end of the year and hopefully it's back on Sky. I want to touch on that, obviously Dalton Smith holding that super lot, like you were called to face him. When do you expect to see that one taking place? Um, he's fighting Samuel Mason in August, so... It doesn't look like it will happen till November times, I'd say. So, uh, yeah, hopefully that fight gets made and he's back on Sky, yeah. From what you've seen of, of Dalton, are you confident that you'd be able to overcome him? Yeah, I'm always confident of any fight that I go into. Um, I wouldn't take a fight if I thought I was going to lose. But, yeah, uh, I feel like I can go and do a job on him. Guys, you've obviously campaigned at Walter. That would be down at Super Walter. Would you, sorry, Light Walter rather. Would you feel com uh, comfortable dropping down? Yeah, I used to make well way easy. Um, I didn't start dieting until, say, like two, three weeks before my fight. And now this is my first time that I'm gonna make 140 officially. So I think the closest I got to was 141. So I know that I can do it and. Come tomorrow, it will be done. <laughs> it's a massive bee that's just landed on your back, mate. So I don't know if you're. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Stung by a wasp before, and it ain't pleasant. <laughs> Rather you than me, mate. I've been one of the lucky ones not to have experienced that. But um, just before I let you go, obviously Sam Higginson getting ready to challenge for the IBO title on Saturday night as well. A camp mate of yours. What are you expected to see from Sam, and how confident are you that he will claim that title and raise it above his head at the end of the night? Uh, I'm very confident. I've. I always, me and Sam always spar, so um, both of our last spars were with each other and he's looking strong, he's uh, sharp, he's moving his head load, so he, as long as he transfers that into onto fight night, he'll definitely come away with a victory. Right, Casey, okay, so we'll leave that there now, leave to shoot off and obviously enjoy the rest of your day and get ready for Wayne tomorrow. Thank you for speaking to me in Boxing Social. Nice one, thanks mate.